Julie, you're live. Okay. Well, you're not I'm live. not live. Don't say that. No. no. Hey, y'all. Welcome to Porch Time. This is Dana. Sitting on the porch thing. <laughs> she in the breeze. That's all I got. That's all you got? That's all I got. No chemtrails. No, no long words of wisdom. Nothing. I don't got it. Well, introduce oh, your friend here. Way Bobby. This is Bobby. Bobby, yes, you're on porch time now. Uh, welcome to porch time. <laughs> We're supposed to be sitting here being mellow waiting to get fat in there with all the food. <laughs> We're not supposed to be on the spot. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, yeah. now now you are in the swing yeah. and it's porch time. Okay, okay. it's porch time. It's porch time, go for it. <laughs> so we have been able to tour the beautiful homestead of Dana Morgan. And nice. it's nice. Yes. We got lots of ideas. Peaceful. Yeah. And you got lots of work to do when Secluded. we get home. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Just what you wanted to hear. <laughs> no, I like the strawberry. Um, oh, That's the amazing. Yes, sir. Yeah, that was very nice. Keep the birds and, and everything off of them. I was like yes. uh, deer netting across our strawberry beds. Yeah. And that worked, but. It's not, not user friendly. Yeah. 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 It's cumbersome. Yeah. You trip over it. And yeah. It, 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 it I've still got one more bed to go. I just got those lids made. I got for the next bed now. I, I took a on. picture of it. I'm going to duplicate yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> I'll go in the penster and I'll see these things. Pictures and stuff, and I like it. That is, yeah. 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 So, I hope you weren't filming. Oh, edited here. Sure. <laughs> the beauty of editing, man. Yeah. Uh, that was a five second haul. I mean, y'all got to do it. I mean, you know, this is like. Talk about a photo bomb. Okay. okay. <laughs> I love their real Four times like 30 minutes. So okay, know. okay. So, we're, so, what are we going to talk about? Spiritual awakening. It's like a spiritual awakening when you come here. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. yeah. We had so, a spiritual awakening. My car throwed up on the way home. Oh, yeah. Maybe. We got yeah. stuck. We had some car trouble. We got stuck on the side of the road. We got stuck in Jackson for about yeah. two hours. Yeah. But God is good. All the yeah, time. Yeah, he took care of it. He took care of it. Yeah. Yes. Got me. Uh, Back on the road. I fixed it myself. Put some oil in it. Changed out of O ring. Yeah. Yeah. It went bad. All these new engines and all these little fancy doodads. It's been very nice to be able to meet everybody. It's just, to me, it's been like, wow, everybody in person. <laughs> all in one location. All in one location. It's crazy. I'm looking so forward to tomorrow and meeting a lot of the subscribers and stuff. It's so yeah. exciting. It's one the, of our subscribers are in our hotel. Yeah. So. The show's from 10 to 4 yeah. tomorrow. Okay. At yeah. the we'll be doing County it. Fairgrounds, right up the road from where you're at. Yeah. Yeah. That's nice. And I loved your greenhouse, by the way. Okay. Yeah. It's like a, it is like a spiritual awakening coming here because you put so much of yourself into your place. And you see it. You can see it, and you've used a lot of wisdom, like you told me before, yeah. from people who have either passed on or older and wiser, and that is so crucial. We don't yeah. we don't stop and listen to older people like we should. I know. I'm one of the very few people that make friends with older people. That's around me. me. Yeah. And I'll go hang out with them. Yeah. And I, I used to smoke. I would go sit and just smoke cigarettes and listen to all their wisdom and yeah. I don't smoke anymore, but I can still sit there and just it's you know, bubble gum. Now it's your bubble gum. <laughs> and my Lots subscribers get on to me about now it. They're like, nobody teeth. Wants... I mean you're long for it next time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh. Yep. It's been a blessing to be here. Thank you for inviting me. Any words in closing? In, in closing, what? Yeah, and it works in closing. Oh, okay. Well, an outro. Um, thank you for inviting us. It's been a blessing to get to know y'all, to, to, to come in and hug y'all and see your place. And it's just been a, a spiritual work. And it's, it's, been a, it's been a blessing. What did you get out of it? What did you really like? I like the two hogs out there. You like the two hogs? I want to get in and wrestle with them, too. Yeah. I love some hogs. Though. He's wild and crazy. He's yeah. Yeah. It's all right. We'll hang you. He, uh, <laughs>
my grandpa said back in the day he kept me back here with the hogs, and I'd be back here with a two by four beating on him. He said, "What you doing, boss? Tenderizing the hogs?" <laughs> just, just in case Free people don't know who you are, just in case people don't know you, you better tell them who you are. Okay. Then I'm Melissa Corley from Full House Homesteaders. I also have done my YouTube channel as Homestead Mom. Yeah. Who's this guy? This is my handsome husband, who's gigantic. And he stands up. He, he almost hits the ceiling. I'm a growing midget. He's a growing right. midget. <laughs> <laughs> okay, gotcha. Thank you, sir.